Hey, this is a demonstration of our API. So as you can see, this is our base URL, and we're gonna post, uh, make a put request. And as you can see, the API responded with a JSON format of three objects. Each of these objects represent a traffic light. As you can see, you can, uh, since we're emulating with the Gemalto device, you can see all the parameters of each Gemalto device. And by the way, these are in real time. So if, if we change this right now to maybe 50%. And we make another request. As you can see, it changed. So slider one to 74, 70. And as you can see, since it's a, a traffic light, it's gonna be, it's gonna have the street's name with it. So UTA Bluffed and Cooper Street and the timer policy which is response to that timer right there and the traffic which is calculated by taking the average of slider one and two all right so we can do a lot of combinations with this uh, we can post a little bit of json in here and we can be like where streets contain and this is college street so we should have one on uta boulevard and college street if you go up here and change this to Cooper. So as you can see, we have two results. We have a traffic light on ETA Boulevard and Cooper Street and on South Netherman Drive and Cooper Street. Another feature of our API is the ability to change values on the board. So this is gonna change the time policy, which is the gonna be emulated by the uh, seven segment display so if we put the value to two and make a request or post as you can see it's changed to two we can set it to whatever value we want so five and there you go we can also change another uh, stuff like the the stoplight so this is going to emulate the stop sign mode so if you set that value to one the LED should come on and if we set it to zero it should turn off and the another thing for the uh, restart restart feature which should be right here so if we set it to one the other LED should come on and if it's zero it should come should turn off all right and that was it thank you